A warm welcome. Blue is the colour. Football is the game, as the old song used to go. We're here at Stamford Bridge tonight in West London. A warm welcome from me, Derek Ray. I'm joined for commentary by the former Arsenal and England defender, Lee Dixon. And without doubt, a match with the potential to bring genuine excitement. It is Chelsea, and they face Union Berlin. I'm excited, Derek. Really looking forward to this game. Come on, bring it on. Here's the lineup for Chelsea. And Goro Conte starts alongside Jorginho in the centre of midfield. And the main striker for this match is Gerard Moreno. This is the lineup for the visitors today. The wing backs are going to be crucial in this setup. You've played in that position, Lee. Yeah, I didn't really like it. And we always thought when we were playing against five at the back with the wing backs exposed like this in this formation, that a 4 4 2 can really create a 2 v 1 down the side. So keep your eye out for that. And the three narrow midfield players supply the support for the two forwards up front. Enjoy the match. It ought to be a really interesting battle. Chelsea kick off. Aspili Quetta. And Goro Conte. Possession lost. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Hudson Odoi. Oh, a nice looking pass. The end product just wasn't there. Cruz. Moving it forward. And intercepted it. Cruiser. Ingvartsen. Good looking ball. There could be a chance now. Andri. Opportunity here. And diving to thwart him. Played into the centre of the box. Suffice it to say, his edge is blunt. Poor effort. Well, he got a lot right there, but he got one thing wrong, and that was the finish. Emerson. And it's a quality pass. It's opening up for them. Can he make it count? Big chance. And a goal! Now they have their opener, and now they can celebrate. Well, here's the replay, Derek, and defenders must defend. They have plenty of time and opportunity to clear this ball, and they've really messed up here. The opening goal of the game, then. Goal for Chelsea. Number 12, Jack Grealish. Knoche. Christopher Trimmel. Not a poor ball giving possession back to the opposition. Now Chelsea in a position of menace. And he's made headway. And finishing there with more of a whimper than a bang. Derek, that reminded me of you finishing like that. It's just terrible. I wouldn't have done that well. 
Ingvartsen. And it's Max Kruse now. And that puts them in position. Oh, maybe the equaliser. Jorginho. They've given it away. Paul Jan Palo. The keeper was never likely to be in trouble then. Mount. Any sort of lead is important. They have the lead. What have you made of it so far? Well, it's all going well for Chelsea. Just, it's tight. Control of the ball is key when a game's like this. They have the players to do it for sure, though. But they'll be the happier of the two teams at half-time. And a wild, wild attempt from long range. Not one for his highlight reel. Well, it's a poor choice. He's got other options on. Why is he shooting from that distance? Gerard Moreno. Jorginho. High quality defending. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. Well, just one minute of time added on for stoppages here. Kruse. Lentz. Pressure exerted, but he keeps the ball and couldn't keep himself onside. And the first 45 minutes have come and gone here at Stamford Bridge. Well, this man will get most of the plaudits for his contribution up to this point, Lee. Well, Derek, you're right. He has played well and goals win games. He's been a joy to watch. Plenty to consider based on what we've seen so far as the second half begins. Has the strength to hang on to it. Well, couldn't keep it. Oh, that's an interesting pass. Oh, my goodness! What an outrageous hit! I can't believe he took it on from there, and neither can the goalkeeper. Well, he's just had a pop, Derek. Absolute blistering strike. Well, let's take another look at that goal, shall we? Well, a second goal for them here. Goal for Chelsea. Number 12, Jack Grealish. Conte well they've lost possession of the ball an attack full of promise well disappointing end to the move Gerard Moreno Moreno on the ball Emerson crisp tackling and that's an important intervention Moreno and that's how to dispossess your opponent Brummel Knoche Andri and it's Max Kruse now He's protecting it effectively. What can he do from here? And failed to keep himself onside, unfortunately. Substitution for Chelsea. And it is substitution time at this juncture. Not just from one side, but from both. Coming onto the pitch, number 17, Matteo Comerson. Chelsea couldn't maintain possession. 
The visitors have totally controlled possession, but they have to create more, they have to be more positive. The final third play has been slow, too predictable. So, 20 minutes to go. Kruse. Christopher Lentz. Can he put it away? Well, the keeper making sure that was pushed well away from danger. Mateo Kovacic. Well, you have to say, goalkeeping at its best, Derek. It really was perfect positioning and a really good save, wasn't it? Pulls it back. Can he play it in? Mateo Kovacic. Well, spot on with that challenge. Ideal for the goalkeeper, for any keeper. Christian Gentner. Only ten minutes remaining here. Gentner. Kruse. Christian Gentner. Andri. Now the attack fizzled out. Now can they counter clinically? And they'll regard that as a very disappointing end to the move. Christopher Trimmel. Prümmel. And in possession, Trimmel. Andri. He's very adept at protecting the ball. And Thiago Silva knows a thing or two about blocking. Substitution then. Let's see how it affects the match. Full time then. The referee's whistle. And Chelsea victorious. That's the big headline, Lee. Well, there's no doubt about the winner in the end and fully deserved for me. The fans can go home happy today, Derek. Well, his performance in this particular game will have impressed many people, Lee. Well, clearly the difference between the two sides today. Two goals, a really good performance, ran into the channel, did everything right. Absolutely, nine out of ten.